Hi everyone, welcome back to WebTech Tutorial once again. In today's tutorial episode, I'm gonna show you how to reset your Walmart password. Keep watching the video till the end to learn how and subscribe to our channel by hitting the subscribe button. Press the bell icon so that YouTube will notify you whenever we post a new video. To reset your Walmart password, go to your web browser and type in www.walmart.com and enter. Click on the account button at the top right and click on the sign in button from the menu. Enter your email address that is associated with Walmart. On the next field, when asked to enter your password, since we have forgotten the password, what we'll need to do is click on Forgot password right below the password box. A click on it will take you to a next page where you'll need to enter your email address and after you're done click on submit. But if you happen to remember your password during the process then you can always sign in with your current password and your credentials. To do so click on sign in and it will take you back to the sign in page where you can enter your credentials and log into your account. Let us reset our password in today's video, so click on Submit once you enter your email. Click on the box to help keep your account safe. And on the next page, a code has been sent to the email address you entered. Go to the email and you'll receive a message from Walmart. Click on it. You'll need to verify that it is you who's resetting your password. So copy this code right here and go back to the sign in page and type in the code. If you didn't receive the code, then you can always ask Walmart to resend you the code by clicking on resend at the right side. Submit the code by clicking on submit code and there is two options where you can sign in and keep the current password or to reset your password, you can click on create a new password. Type in the new password that you are trying to change to. Make sure that your password is of 7200 characters and the one that you have not used before. Click on the continue button and you can even add a phone number for keeping your account more secure and once you type in your phone number, you can always update the phone number anytime in your account. If you don't wanna type in your phone number, then click on not now and that is how you can reset your Walmart account with a new password. I hope the tutorial was helpful to you. If it was, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Feel free to comment down below in the comment box if you have a question or a feedback for us. I'll see you soon with more tutorial episodes. Goodbye till then.